In America, the wage war continues. The wealth gap ratio between CEOs and employees is 350 to 1. Drug cartels don't even have that much of a wealth gap. This is more like a wealth ravine. At the bottom of it, you just find piles and piles of unused monies that say not for serfs. This issue isn't even focused on by the media and or corporations. All the corporations out there, like Walmart, are more concerned with mandating a new dress code of khakis and a dress shirt. It makes no sense that a Walmart employee would be better dressed than a Walmart customer. Besides, drug cartels have had a business casual dress code since like 1982. Business casual and in this sense is a nice dress shirt, nice pants, and a jacket that can hold at least $25,000 worth of drugs. With a wealth gap ratio of 350 to 1, corporations should really consider giving back to their employees or at least back to their communities. Hell, even Pablo Escobar gave back to his community in soccer balls and hippos. But corporate America would rather have the caricature of a rich tyrant with the dollar sign eyes, big suits and cigars, and laughing while burning $100 bills into a reality. It's starting to become clear that working for a drug cartel is actually better than working for a corporation. Not only would you be more respected and paid better, but you'd also get to wear jeans every day.